If we continue following of the tragic story that has gripped the nation, President Trump is even weighing in on the disappearance and resulting death of University of Iowa student Molly Tibbetts. A Mexican man here in the U.S. illegally is being charged in the 20-year-old's death. This morning, Laura Podesta has the latest on the president's words and the criminal investigation. At a rally in West Virginia last night, the president brought up a story gripping the nation, the death of college student Molly Tibbetts. Her body was found yesterday in an Iowa cornfield 12 miles from where she went missing July 18th. You heard about today with the illegal alien coming in very sadly from Mexico, and you saw what happened to that incredible, beautiful young woman. Should have never happened, illegally in our country. The president was talking about this man, Christian Bahena Rivera. The 24-year-old is accused of following Tibbetts while she was out for a run, then kidnapping and killing her. How she died is still not known. I can tell you that an autopsy was going to be performed that'll assist us. Rivera had worked nearby for Yarraby Farms, which is owned by the family of Craig Lang, a prominent Republican who'd previously served as president of the Iowa Farm Bureau. The company said Rivera had passed the government's vetting process and was an employee in good standing. Earlier this month, Tibbetts' parents told CBS News their daughter had so much to look forward to, including her first trip abroad. She couldn't have been any happier. This has been the summer of a lifetime. The psychology major would have started her junior year this week. Laura Podesta, CBS News, New York. Rivera will make his first court appearance today in Montezuma, Iowa. He is being jailed on $1 million cash-only bond.